Uh, what motivates me the most about uh, my research uh, is the unique applications which can impact people's life a lot. I'm the director of Terahertz Electronics Lab at the University of Michigan. Together with my research team, we're working on developing high-performance electronic and optoelectronic components, as well as imaging and spectroscopy systems, which operate at terahertz frequencies. Uh, terahertz is a portion of electromagnetic spectrum, which is between optical and microwave regions. A lot of times people refer to this portion of the spectrum as terahertz gap, and the reason is that traditional electronic and uh, optical devices don't operate efficiently at these frequency ranges. On the other hand, terahertz waves have very unique and valuable specifications that make scientific community not give up on uh, this uh, terahertz gap and try to find new technologies and new techniques to close this uh, spectral gap. As an example, uh, a lot of molecules and chemicals have a unique spectral fingerprint in terahertz region, which makes terahertz a unique platform for non-invasive chemical detection. Also, terahertz waves can pass through a lot of non-conductive materials and packages, which makes it unique for uh, security screening, medical imaging, and uh, applications like that. Today's terahertz uh, imaging and spectroscopy systems are very power inefficient, they are very bulky and very hard to operate with. We are hoping with the research that we conduct in the terahertz electronics gap and by the new technologies that we bring to the table, we make these devices more efficient, more compact and more portable such that we can revolutionize the imaging and chemical detection industry in the future. What I like students to gain from their education from University of Michigan is not only abstract science and engineering and the fundamentals which is required in their career, but also to learn to be independent thinkers and uh, learn how to approach new problems and new challenges without being afraid of that. I would like to see students who uh, broaden their knowledge, not only about electrical engineering while they're here, but also about other disciplines. We know the boundary between electrical engineering, chemistry, biology, mechanical engineering is becoming less and less distinct as time passes by. The problems of next generation will be very interdisciplinary. So if students broaden their knowledge in all fields, they can really find realistic solutions to the problems of next generation.